Today I'm going to be making a terrarium, um, a closed one. I'm going to open it at some point, but it's going to be closed for now. And it's going to have, it's going to be in this jar. Um, I'm going to put some uh, isopods, roly polies, pill bugs, whatever you call them. Um, worms, earthworms, mostly. Um, I don't think I'll be putting my slug in, the one I have now, curry. I don't know if you've seen that video, but if you haven't, go check it out. Um, it, um, and if I do find, like, another slug or something, I'll be adding that in there, like a snail maybe. Uh, some different things that I find, but I know there's definitely going to be isopods, because that was kind of the point of this, and I did find some earlier, so I know where they are. But first, I'm going to get started and put soil in. I should probably get a shovel. I'll pick up the camera once I have one. Okay, so I have a shovel. Um, and I think I'm just going to use this um, just dirt. I should probably need a different pair of shoes. But I'm going to use dirt from just right here in my backyard. This used to be... This used to have sawdust in it, and it would be like the biggest area that um, grubs would be in. But um, the sawdust is gone now. Well, there's just some over there, but most of it's gone, and now it's just dirt. And I don't know what's in there, and I'm not gonna do like the whole treating the dirt or whatever you do process because well I want there to be stuff in it like different organisms and things hopefully not deadly ones but some oh I should I'm gonna um pat this down that's what I have in it I'm gonna pat it down my hand I don't even know if my hand will fit in here Okay, I think that's good enough. And, um, I'll come back here for the lid. But, I'm gonna go out in my front yard to get some patches of moss, some different weeds that will hopefully spread around for some coverage for the animals that would be in here. And I know a pot that I can lift up and there would definitely be something in it because in my previous video, when I was looking for millipedes, once again, if you haven't seen that, go check it out. I lifted up a pot and there's some isopods and worms and other things. But first, I'm gonna get moss. Um, so, I didn't realize, but um, my camera just stopped recording. Um, but I got a weed and I have the moss in there. Just dropped the weed. But. I got the moss in there. Um, I can't believe I didn't realize my just stopped filming. Anyways, I hope that also spreads. Um, I don't really want to. This is this. It looks so plain, but I don't know what else to add. Um. I guess leaf litter will take up some space. I'll add some more stuff later, but this is just on video. I'll do some um, stuff off camera. Add some leaf litter in there. Uh, I need better leaves. Okay, that's good enough for me. I'll do some other stuff. Just lift this up. Um, yes, everything is still there. Whoa. That is a lot of isopods. Wow. Oh, sorry, am I making you guys fall? Um, I'll just take the ones on the bottom. I'll add this um, worm. 
Ew, it's pooping on me. Ugh. Can you just cooperate, please? What about you? Be a good one. Bye. Um. Uh. Get this. Uh, isopod. Put it in there. Oops. Are you okay? Yeah, here we go. Um. I saw a video about how to, like, get springtails. I need you guys to let me in the, know in the comments if this is true. But the guy in the video, I'll try to link it down below. But the guy in the video um, filled up a cup with water and then took some compost and also put that in the water. And then used, like, a little dropper and dripped some of that compost water into his terrarium. I don't know if that just makes, like... Um, springtails like spawn, but just, I just need to, yeah. So let me know if that's actually true. Uh, get a few more isopods. Let me know in the comments who you guys are wanting to win the Super Bowl. Uh, I'm pretty sure, I don't really like sports, but my family wants the Chiefs to win. So let me know what you guys, what your guys' opinion is on who you want to win in the Super Bowl. Just take this last one and it's good enough for me. Isopods. Enough. Enough isopods, but I want that worm. Where'd it go? I guess it just stuck itself into the ground. I'll come back later and see if it came back up. Alright, that's the end of the video. Bye guys.